if I'm talking the facts. All my life been bound in the back. 180 my life when I got in a rap. Hardest hey, made me wanna get strapped. Uh. But now I'm known all over the map. So Hey guys, my name is Kim, welcome back to my channel and today I'm showing you guys how to create this very sexy, sultry, smoky, halo eye, matte, glowy, I don't know what to call this video but um, I'm gonna show you how to create this look so if you wanna see it then please keep on watching make sure to subscribe and thumbs up this video if you like this look so let's get started so as usual I have my brows done and my lids primed so I'm just gonna dust it off with a little bit of my face powder and then we're ready for eyeshadow. So for today I'm using the Pixie It's Judy Time eyeshadow palette and it is called It's Eye Time. And the first shade I'm gonna go in with is the shade Good Morning and as always I'm applying this inside my crease. And I'm also applying this to the inner and outer part of the lid. Taking a smaller brush in the shade Night Night. And I'm focusing this on the outer and inner part of the eye. And I'm softly blending that shade in the crease. Going back in with the previous shade and blending it out. Taking that same Night Night shade and this time taking it underneath the lash line. Now I'm taking the shade Getaway. And this shade I'm gonna apply on the blank space I left open. I'm gonna go back in with a little bit more of Night Night and really hug that shade and blend the two together. Now taking the shade It's Mommy's Life and I'm applying that shade underneath the brow. And also to the inner corners. So I thought I wanted to do a halo on the bottom too but I think I'm just gonna fill it in with Night Night. Gonna go in with a little bit of Anastasia Dark Side Liner. I hope you can't hear the rain because it started raining like crazy. So that is it for the eyes. I'm gonna zoom you guys back out and start with the skin. My eyes and brows are very dark visible. We're quickly going to apply some foundation and contour so that it balances everything out. Um, for today, as a primer, I'm gonna use the By Kelsha 24 Karat Gold Facial Elixir. Okay, so I don't know what's going on today, but my pores are so big. So I'm also gonna grab a primer for that. Tarte Poreless Mattifying Primer. Gonna fill up those babies. Taking the Lancome Tante Edel Ultra Wear, and I'm mixing that with the NARS All Day Luminous Weightless Foundation. Just stipple it all over the face. Okay, so for concealer, I'm taking the Tarte Shape Tape. I'm just dotting that over my face. Going back in with my pencil brush to smudge that lower line lash line out. Gonna powder a tiny little bit because it is pretty matte. And I'm using my MAC Studio Sculpt Defining Powder in Light. So I'm just only lightly going to powder the places I want to contour because I don't want it to become patchy or anything. Contour today I'm using the Tarte Park A Princess. And I just like to use a big brush so this is the Morphe R7. And because my eye look is pretty heavy I'm really gonna bronze up my skin. Moving on to blush I have this Pixie Espen Overd blush. A very very pretty blush oh it is very pigmented but it is very pretty so for highlighter today of course I'm using my own brand Meraki Cosmetics and today I'm using the shade Cleo I just love this shade let's move on to a lippy what should I go for light 
super good. I don't know. No, I think honey is good. So I'm going to use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Matte Lipstick in the shade Honey. So I really like the matte, but maybe I'm just going to apply a lip topper over top. I'm going to use the Jouer Lip Topper in Skinny Dip. This is so pretty. So now I'm going to finish this up with a little bit of my Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. My hair is not fixable today, so we're just going to work with it, I guess. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and also let me know if you like the glossy or the matte more. I will put it up here or here, the pole. And also let me know if you guys like this angle more or when I'm sitting more back here. I think that this is better so that you guys can really, really see what I'm doing. Um, so just let me know in the comments down below. Thank you guys so much for watching and as I said in the beginning, make sure to subscribe and click the notification bell if you haven't already. So thank you so much again and I hope to see you guys in my next video.